Oh, I have such inspiration. I'm gonna build a beautiful home. Is this good? I think it looks good. <coughs> Just instead of building a box, why not making the house a little bit more interesting? Adding something, deleting something, not making it square, make it a little bit more rectangular. Add another room or two at the sides. It's gonna be great. You can do it. Oh yes, yeah, so all the bills needs to be a little bit more interesting, right? So I'm gonna add this interesting part here, this architectural thing here. It looks great, it looks great, it's awesome, it's awesome, I like it. I suggest not going crazy with crazy walls because it makes everything harder, it makes the building harder, the roofing harder, uh, furnishing the inside harder, so just add some interesting part to your build and that's great but don't make your build unlivable or unmakeable or don't make it bad just try a little bit less so i built this beautiful modern build you know what's missing mm, i'm gonna put a door and i guess some windows mm, more windows i guess we really need windows in this build Let's add some more windows, because windows are cool. Let's add windows. I know I do the same thing, but just take a step back. Look at the house. Take out some windows. They are always too much. Just take a second, look at it, and be like, oh, this window is not needed. Let's take it out, and it's going to be better. Fuck it. This roof is fine. I don't know what else to do, honestly. It's going to look good. Just take a little bit of time, make the roof make sense. If you don't know how a roof looks, I suggest going on Google and look for a house similar to the one you built and look at a roof that it's made on that, on that kind of house and repeat it in the game. You can do it. It's easy, make easy, simple, not crazy roofs and the house is going to look great. Look at this house. I'm going to add a couple of windows. I'm going to add a little bit of color and it's going to look so much better than it did before. Just changing the roof, it's just crazy how much it changes the spirit the experience and the exterior of the home you know what this house looks amazing i'm just gonna add a fence and that's gonna be it just take some time put a couple of trees put a bush or two and the house is gonna be so much better just take my word for it it looks better Okay, let's put the tree here, a tree there, a little bit of grass, I think, underneath the tree is gonna look good, and that's... <coughs> Just take 10 seconds of your life to add a little bit of shading underneath the trees, and it's gonna look 10 times better. Okay, this house is great, but the walls are so empty i'm gonna have to add something this is empty i need to add more let's add another one here i think it looks great i need another more i think another one because it it, it really needs more and another painting here it looks great yeah i think it looks good another painting maybe another one even maybe yeah let's do that let's do you don't need every single wall to be filled in just add a couple of paintings here and there and you can have an empty space and it's fine have an empty wall if you don't want an empty wall just add some i don't know an, a feature wall change the colors of it you don't need a painting on every single walls just think of a real house a real house doesn't have paintings in every blank space so it's fine to not have them everywhere just make sure they look good and they fit the theme of the house <laughs> You know what looks good? Black and white. We love black and white. I don't want any color. Black and white. Black and white. It looks great and it's awesome and I love it. I wanted that. <coughs> this is the thing that I do as well. Just take a step back and think. You don't really want to live in a space that it's all black or all white or just a mix of those two colors. You love colors. Everybody does. Unless your sim is specific to need this type of colors. Add a little bit of nice things here and there, a little bit of something, a little bit of a pop of color. 
okay this room just is done it's fine it's okay it has everything that you need it's done <coughs> this is something that i used to do a lot at first when i started building in the sims 4 or in the sims in general is not adding some clutter here and there adding some decoration really gives a, a whole lot of ups aspect to your rooms and to your home makes it more lived in makes it more i don't know feel like a home like actually somebody lives there if you take some time and putting some some clutter in and it's gonna it's gonna look great just don't overdo it as it is for the paintings just a little bit you don't need too much but something to make it like a livable space like it's somebody is actually in there it's not like a weird room empty and abandoned by everybody oh um, i'm gonna choose some colors they are gonna be fine i guess i like this one it's fine mm. try and make an effort matching the colors in your house using colors that go together if you don't know what kind of colors go together if you don't know color theory you don't need that just you know find an object that you like like a carpet and go from that use the colors that are in that carpet to furnish the rest of the house and try and keep the colors for like woods similar and the walls or like similar Keep that in mind when you do that, when you furnish.